What's going on guys? This video is dedicated to my Patreon supporter Bobby from Chalk and Heartbreak Hotline video games. The man has always been extremely super supportive to me, and so I'm giving back and letting you guys know about this extremely wild, wacky, and violent project that's in the works that's, well, called Zebra Killer. I know a lot of subscribers on my channel are fans of crazy, over-the-top, violent manga such as Chainsaw Man or Doro Hidoro, and I feel like this property is going to give you a very similar vibe as those two. In the sense that just about anything can happen, and we are living in a world similar to our own but with some extreme chaotic differences. And maybe even add in a splash of Frank Miller's Sin City comics. It does take place in Vegas after all. Put all that in a blender, throw in a zebra mask, and you have, well, Zebra Killer. The plot goes like this. In the City of Lights, a serial killer will find love. Then, trouble finds him. What happens when society breaks down, and the weeping city has no heroes? Its youth has no future, and its citizens, no hope. Gangs and a ragtag bunch of misfits rule the streets, and crooked cops and immoral men rule everything else. But when one of these beasts unearths a forbidden technology that gives him the power to kill once more, things take a very homicidal turn for the worse. Now, bitter enemies must band together and save what's left of humanity from this dystopian nightmare, if they don't kill each other first. Zebra Killer by Chuck is an action horror noir thriller set in an alternative history after a cataclysmic event swallows the sun whole. Creep with the God King's militant animals on a perilous journey as they face unspeakable psychological horrors and shadow demons with a whole mess of juvenile violence just thrown right in. Welcome to the heartbreak. So the overall goal for this is for Zebra Killer to become an action beat-em-up style video game for you to play and adding and incorporating in some first-person shooter levels as well, but also meant to be a multimedia type franchise idea with various tie-ins and different ways that you can experience it. The team is putting together an audio drama episode series that you can listen to, sort of like a podcast style, and follow along the story in that format alongside the game. The pilot episode and trailer have been uploaded to their YouTube channel, the links will both be down in the description below, as well a link to the pocketbook edition of the story that you can grab over on Amazon. And this is an entire team of people that are working on this. They are putting together not just the game, but doing all of the voice acting, the sound effects, the music, and really trying to make this as immersive of an experience as they possibly can. Also, when you head on over to their Patreon page, you get a lot more information about this world that they're creating, and it doesn't just end with the zebra killer scenario, it's actually this whole entire storyline of this post-apocalyptic world that they're coming up with to add in all of these different kind of games and audio dramas and things of that nature. You get a lot more detail information about the world that they're creating, and also there is a couple of links here that you can check out that are really cool. One is this great, amazing animated short that, like I said, really reminds me of Sin City, and definitely ties into that universe as well, which I think is really, really cool. Definitely worth checking out. At least check out the animation and how this motion comic was sort of brought together. I think it's absolutely phenomenal. shade deeply casted by my lucky hat looms heavily over wicked cool eyes wicked cool killer precise They were like 
lightning. And her hips. Her hips were thunder. Crazy goddamn broad. She's been chasing me longer than forever. Finally, I had the upper hand. My name is Scott Ryan, and I'm about to tell you what hell is really like. So these are the guys trying to put this together, the guys you gotta watch out for, these guys are awesome, they're great, they're great supporters of mine. You have Bobby Ryan who came up with the story and wrote the concepts for this universe, he's also the producer, the game developer, and one of the voice actors. Bronson Gary who's also a producer, a co-writer, and a pixel artist. And I'm really sorry if I butcher your name bro, Ignacio Montes de Orca is the lead programmer creating the video game. Uh, here are some snippets actually from the audio drama itself. Give a man a mask and he'll become his true self. Give a man a gun, and he'll become whoever he wants. Give a man a purpose, and he'll take over the world. I'm not sure what purpose the mask serves, but I went through a hell of a lot more than I bargained for getting that piece to you. Consider this payback for that favor I owe you. Never contact me again. Goodbye. Now I think the idea is incredibly ambitious and I love seeing people expressing their art and talents. And I'm also impressed that instead of just doing one thing, they are expanding the creativity on various levels of their series to be explored in different kinds of arts and mediums. The only downside to me is that there are no gameplay or teasers of the game to show you guys yet in this video. I know having that would make it feel like more of a reality to help hype you up to check it out, but also you gotta realize that this takes a lot of time to accomplish. Hell, all I do is review stuff on YouTube, add in a full-time job and some other obligations, and I have pretty much zero free time. So I can't imagine how long it would take to branch out in this many directions and get this thing done completely the way that they need to. Not to mention that it takes the funding as well, which you're free to contribute to their Patreon or PayPal down below. Links will also be in the description of this video. So bearing all that in mind, the time, attention, and dedication, and funding that it would take to create all of this and the video game, I think it's really impressive what these guys are setting out to do. Other than that, I just like the idea of a guy in a zebra mask blasting his way through a dystopian Las Vegas. <laughs> I mean, come on, let's just get this made. You can also listen to the audio drama version on both YouTube and Spotify. And like I said, go follow their channel as well as all the other links that will be provided in the description down below. Their production team is spelled C-H-V-L-K, pronounced Chuck, and you can go follow them on Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, and YouTube. So what do you guys think? Is this wild, crazy idea something that you would be interested in? As you can see, this is mostly an announcement video to help support and spread the word and help get these guys what they need in order to get this done. These guys have been incredibly supportive to me over the time and hopefully this helps in a way to give back and also to continue to be in an artist supporting artist mindset. 
definitely one thing I want to make sure I can do is give back to you guys that have supported me along my journey. And also, if you would like a video dedicated to promoting something of yours, whether it would be your YouTube channel, music, webcomic, or anything else, consider becoming a Patreon member of mine. There's a few ways you can do it. There's the $10 tier that gets you a shout out and a promo in a video, and the $50 Miura Sensei tier that gets you a video request of anything that you would like minus a few stipulations. We'll work out the details one-on-one, -on -one, but it will be an entire video dedicated to either something you want me to promote, something to review, cover, uh, anything that you want, or just a video topic that you think would be interesting that you'd like to see me talk about. This tier also takes top priority, meaning that as soon as you donate and we work out the details, I begin working on the video right away and get it up as soon as possible as a thank you for contributing to the channel. If that's not your style and you just want to contribute to the channel anyway, you could always pick up an item from my merch store or just simply watch, like, and comment on the videos, free of charge. It's all up to you. But I thank you for watching this video and I really hope that you check out the boys and girls over at Chalk and give Zebra Killer a chance. When they release the full version of the game, I will definitely be playing it and probably giving some feedback on this channel about it as well. Anyways guys, thank you again for giving me and them a bit of your time today and hopefully you can throw some support over their way. I hope you guys have a wonderful day wherever you are. Thank you for watching this video, and I'll talk to you in the next one.